Macular degeneration. What are intravitreal eye injections? Have you ever wondered how doctors treat certain eye diseases, especially macular degeneration? One of the most common treatments for wet age-related macular degeneration is intravitreal injections. This method involves injecting medication directly into the vitreous humor, which is the gel-like substance inside your. The goal is to target the retina and macula, areas essential for sharp central vision. Intravitreal injections primarily deliver antivascular endothelial growth factor medications, often referred to as anti-VEGF drugs. Vascular endothelial growth factor is a protein that can cause the growth of abnormal blood vessels in the retina. These fragile vessels can leak fluid and blood, leading to damage in the macula and loss of vision, particularly in wet macular degeneration. Anti-VEGF medications work by blocking this protein, which helps reduce the growth and leakage of these abnormal vessels. Sometimes, doctors may also use steroids to reduce inflammation or antibiotics and antivirals to treat infections in the eye, depending on the specific condition being treated. The procedure is usually performed in a clinical setting. First, the eye is numbed with anesthetic drops to minimize discomfort. Then, a very fine needle is used to inject the medication into the vitreous cavity. While the thought of an injection in the eye can be nerve-wracking, most patients find it quick and tolerable when done by an experienced ophthalmologist. Intravitreal injections have revolutionized the treatment of wet macular degeneration. Studies show that they can prevent further vision loss in about 95% of patients and even improve vision in up to 40%. However, it is essential to note that this treatment is not a cure. Patients typically requiring ongoing injections, often monthly or every few months, to maintain the benefits. The benefits of intravitreal injections include direct delivery of medication to the retina, which allows for faster and more effective absorption. This method also allows for personalized treatment plans, reducing the risk of systemic side effects compared to oral medications. Additionally, it may decrease the need for more invasive treatments like laser therapy or surgery. While the risks associated with intravitreal injections are generally low, they can include eye infections, increased eye pressure, retinal detachment, or inflammation. Regular follow-up appointments are crucial to monitor the effectiveness of the treatment and the overall health of the eye. In conclusion, Intravitreal injections are a vital treatment option for wet macular degeneration and other retinal diseases. They work by delivering medication directly into the eye, helping to inhibit abnormal blood vessel growth and leakage. This treatment is safe and effective when performed by care specialists. If you or someone you know is dealing with macular degeneration, it is essential to consult an ophthalmologist for personalized advice and ongoing management.